What's that one now? I can't remember. I can't remember the, the name of that one. There is one in the white bottle by Tokyo Makinwa. There is one in the white bottle. There is one in the red bottle. And there is one in the black bottle. My favorite of all the three is the one in the white bottle. I like that one a lot. So for all the Nigerian brands that I've tried, I am not even going to lie. I like all of them. I like all of them. There is, there is um, an intentionality behind, behind the production of these perfumes. There is, there is, a, there is an intentionality. Now the juice is not. Now when it comes to um, some of all these affordable perfumes, they all smell similar in a way. This one is smelling like this one. This one is smelling like this one. So if you're not very intentional about buying, you end up buying different perfumes, but they smell the same. Like you buy the same perfume in different bottles. That is one of the disadvantage for me, for you know, of buying some of all these affordable um, dupe perfumes because they smell like they smell the same. Okay, so right now I am so intentional about buying perfumes that like before I buy, I not only check out reviews, I go to Fragrantica, is it Fragrantica.com? And then I check out what that perfume smells like. There is a, there is a place in Fragrantica that, you know, shows what this perfume smells like. Now, I will see how many people have voted that this perfume smells like this. That will give me a pointer to letting me know what this perfume smells like. If it's a perfume that I don't enjoy, I don't like, I don't just bother, I don't just waste my time buying. I don't just waste my time buying, I just, I don't buy. Okay, so that is how I am able to, you know, check for these perfumes before I buy them I'm able to you know be very critical I watch reviews I you know see what people are saying about the perfume don't get me wrong sometimes people can talk things you know people can say this perfume is not good it's bad it's this it's that it's that and then I end up trying the perfume and I end up liking it a lot okay so what I would like to say as well is that sometimes we also need to try perfumes for ourselves because sometimes people like some things and when you, excuse me, when you, um, people will try some perfumes and they will hate it, but when you try it, you end up liking it. So um, people's experience, people's, um, people's experience shape shape their sense of smell you know the type of perfumes they have smelled growing up the type of perfumes they have interacted with those are some of the things that can affect the choices of someone's taste in perfume so i would say sometimes in as well as we watch reviews and hear what other people are saying concerning a particular perfume is also good for us to try our perfume for ourselves okay if you you know think you like a perfume don't especially if the perfume is very expensive don't just go in and just commit your hard-earned money into buying a full bottle you can buy out you can buy um you can buy testers okay you can buy testers you can buy decans you can buy you know just to try out to see if it's something you would like right Try out these perfumes and see if it's something you like before you commit your money to buying some of these perfumes. Okay, so, so yeah. Thank you so much for spending your time with me today on my life. Till I come your way again, my name is Gloria. Don't forget to keep living your best. God loves you. I'll see you in my next video or in my next life. Okay, thank you and bye-bye.